Hello, welcome to lesson three. Lesson three continues our discussion with the stages of change model and um, introduces the assessment and screening process. I should say screening and assessment process for folks um, involved in substance use disorders. We have uh, a textbook reading uh, to complete. I've included some supplemental readings um, on uh, juvenile justice screening instruments, um, online course information. Uh, we have included um, uh, some information on clinical drug testing, uh, a popular screening instrument called the SANSI that I have used um, since 1995, uh, some information on the assessment process, and DS DSM-5 information as well. Um, for the online course information, don't feel pressure to read every single page uh, of every single document. Um, or even for the juvenile justice screening instrument document. I have given you a lot of information today that uh, the best thing to do is, is to uh, basically scroll through, look at some of the high points, read what you're most interested in, and scam. Don't feel pressure to read every single, uh, every single page. You will not be able to. Part of the educational process is to begin learning how to uh, narrow your reading process down and learning what bits of information you need to read uh, verbatim and intently and what other, other bits of information you need to skim and, and kind of speed read and look for common themes, ideas, theories, and those type of things. Um, we, we have several videos to watch too. One video that's quite long. Uh, and another one that is extremely short, along with two discussion board postings. Um, as always, if you have questions, please let me know. Take care.